Shalom and greetings to you all, Yisraya Reach, Zaiwi Yisraya, and my precious Isha. Rafeya Yisraya. We greet you in your Yeshua's mighty name. This is an invitation that we are extending to all of you, our friends, our listeners, our supporters, for the wonderful gathering that we shall all participate in in Sukkot and the Moed of Yad that is rapidly approaching. All the information is on our website. You will see the dates below as uh, I am speaking to you all. We want to invite you for a wonderful gathering here in Kashua community for Sukkot. We do have some Sukkot that are available for you that will come and visit. So we want to extend uh, this warm invitation to you all to come and to be a part of this great festivity of an occasion like none other event that you have participated in. There is no purchasing of food or anything of that nature. Everything is free, there is sufficient, and there will be more than enough for you and your family. We want you to come uh, for this great occasion that, as I said, is rapidly upon us. There will be wonderful activities. Rafael, are there some type of activities that they hope you all will gather and participate in certain kinds of events. Yes. Inform them what will be happening at that time. Yes, we will have some of uh, we have a young girl that makes soap. So there'll be homemade soap making. Uh, we're gonna show you some techniques you can on how to sew, putting in a zipper and how easy it is to put a button on uh, a piece of a uh, garment. Hallelujah. And so what type of seminars? We'll, we, I, I know the theme, we have already, I've already established the theme of the, of, the, uh, of, the, of the feast day. I have not discussed that with you. This is just an impromptu video. We want to invite you all, Yisraya. But there will be seminars of teaching that yes, you will be leading. Yes. And the other whole time, they're inspirational and things of that nature whereby we can strengthen the body of Yisraya. So Raphael will be teaching and inspiring the occult only. She will not be teaching men. And in those gatherings, men are not welcome. We do have the facilities here to facilitate many. We have a dining facility that can facilitate at least 200 people. But we have a beautiful gathering. We're here in the plaza, here at the core pond. We were hoping that they would come and eat out of our hands. So we are here in the plaza. We will have services in the plaza. We will have, uh, in the soup coffee, we will have services here in this beautiful outdoor facility. We have the tabernacle. We have another tabernacle whereby there will be meetings with the art. We have art that will be teaching on a variation of different things, a simple gardening. We have our art simeon that will be showing anyone that need assistance on how to grow herbs or anything we will be doing that so it's going to be a wonderful occasion we are laboring now to make sure that we can facilitate all that will come we're trying to rapidly to get our park up to par to finish that and also uh, my uh, Simeon is working on our grill and they hope we'll be cooking all kinds of delicacies will they not yes sir. what kinds of things will you all be cooking baking uh, well, uh, we'll have some of Sakia's favorite uh, homemade cookies. Um, you know, Sister Yasha Shine will be frying the fish. Beautiful. Uh, she has a, a new batter that she puts on the fish, so we're going to try that uh, this time. And just other things. I hadn't really talked with the sisters yeah. all about the menu, but we've just been uh, brainstorming things on what we're going to prepare for that time. All right, so it will be not an insufficient of great calories, uh, to increase your waistline and things like that. Do not come to Teshua worrying about your waistline. During this great event, we will enjoy the abundance of Yah, his, his produce and the abundance of his riches that we will eat, we will dine, we will fellowship, we will sing, we will dance, we will have a great interaction with each other. It's going to be a wonderful, sensational time and it is a time for that, that our children can rejoice uh, and understand the beauty of these events of Yah, that the purpose of that we establish in their lives, uh, that as they grow older, if Yah grants it, that they will understand the magnitude 
of this occasion. So again, we as uh, here in Teshua, my Ishor Rafea and I, 35 plus years of marriage, uh, Yah has granted unto us to, to live faithfully and honorable and honest with each other. And we invite you all to come to be with us uh, uh, on this wonderful occasion. Uh, do not worry about any kind of food or any things. The dates are listed right here. You can see the dates here. They are listed here. So you, are, you will know the dates and the time of service. We will have a, a beautiful um, uh, activities and events that will take place. Uh, so we want you to come. We extend our hands. We open our hearts to you all to come. Also, we do have the ability to facilitate those that want to put up their sukhat. We ask you to bring your own tent or something that is temporary whereby you will sleep. And also, there are hotels in the area that uh, do uh, accommodate us and do give us bargains and their prices when there are people that are coming uh, to visit us here at Tashua. So we look forward to all Yisrael to be with us in this great event of Sukkot, the Feast of Tabernacle, and the last great day to enjoy the aesthetics of Teshua community, and above all that, the aesthetics and the fellowship and friendship of others, even close to your locality that you know not of, whereby that there may be a fellowship between you and them. So from Reach Dawid and my precious Isha Rafael Yisraya, we say to you all Yisraya greetings um, and we welcome you all to this great Moed in Yahshua's name. So may the riches of your rest upon you all and may the splendor of his excellence, the knowledge of his Torah fill your bosom with great delight. Uh, again, we say you're welcome to Teshua community. And your shoe is mighty name. Any last words, my Rabbeah? Shalom, shalom. Shalom, shalom, Yisrael, and Yabrach. <laughs>